bathroom, but how you look at, the, at this bath, this place. It's not just one again, it's not one single element. Oh, look at the nice faucet, look at the nice toilets, that's not that. First of all, it's French. <laughs> No, no, it's just a joke like at first glance, but in reality, you cannot find any more or any longer uh, French company providing you sanitary uh, products. In reality, most of them, they are Italian or German, and we do that for uh, now for 130 years. So it's a second point, which is not that, uh, that uh, let's say, uh, obvious that you can find so much brand, so much old brand like this. There, what is the third point? You, we, get, we do have integrated designer. I mean, my guys, we are five. We, uh, we all work only for Jacob de la Fon, design all the, the single things that you can find all around you here. Not just doing, oh yeah, I'm doing a nice looking product. No, that's not what I'm doing. You are kind of in between uh, an engineer and an artist. And I think if you know well, if you understand well all the product process, all the development process, you are exactly the right person to fit this position. And now I'm there for 19 years, I guess, uh, means that I was uh, fitting this kind of uh, requirement. Um, so what else could we do? What do you want? So first of all, this uh, our headquarters still uh, used to be in Paris, you know, Paris Central, downtown. And Mr. Maurice de la Fond, you know that Jacob de la Fond, there are two people. Huh? And Emil Jacob was more the uh, engineer designer. We were based in Paris for my, my, I would love really that everybody enter a showroom and can recognize at first glance our products and oh yes, that's a JD product or Jacob de la Fon, sorry, a JD or Jacob de la Fon product because, because the, the, uh, the style we define, this Parisian style we define is get kind of very, very uh, uh, repetitively visible. If you look, for instance, at a collection such as uh, Nouvelle Vague, you get this, uh, this uh, shower screen looks like a canopy, we call that Verrier in Paris, which is exactly the, 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 the feel we want to bring through our collection. I remember, oh yeah, in the 2000s, cars gonna fly and all that. There's not, not so much flying cars outside. We, we spend our time with our cell phone all day long, I mean, if you can sometimes go back to roots, sincerely, I think everybody loves that. So you go to a place where you just take of you, take care of yourself, of your body, and you are you are dealing with water. No, no, I think this 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 relationship you have during the time you are in the bathroom with yourself and your body make important that you have authenticity around you. So if I if I really look back on the material, ceramic, solid wood, marble. Um, brass, gold finish, and uh, and even uh, glass for for top are keep on coming back. And I remember at the time there, there were a lot of synthetic worktop or you know a solid surface which are nice and you get this. Um, but in reality, you can do as even better than that in ceramic, and you get a real natural feel which you don't really add uh, with the with the solid stone stuff. Flight is like a a super version of what is acrylic. We are we have here several products made out of that. We have a, the shower tray. We have bathtub. And what is interesting is so you get so you get the thermal form foil acrylic foil on top and on bottom, and in between you get some kind of concrete uh, that make the core. So we thermal form the first one. We thermal form the second one, and then we pour it between this concrete that makes the thing super robust. So if you look at bathtub like Elite that we have around here, you can see the details on the different uh, radius and the different step can bring in the bathtub. So that's very important for that. And then this one you cannot crash the thing. I mean, and what is nice also is that as you have a two uh, two two layer of uh, of acrylic, you can also play on the color. Uh, inside can be still the glossy white, for instance, and outside it could be uh, uh, a matte black or a matte... So, if you look around you and if you do a tour, you, well, you can see that everything that's made out of wood, of solid wood, is what we call PFC. I don't know if this sounds uh, something to you, if you're really male, but that means that every time we are cutting a, a, a tree, we just uh, put, put a new one. So, it's uh, to make sure that we do that 
environmental friendly. Uh, all the lighting system are LED, so it's a low tension, less electricity used. Uh, all our uh, most of, so we are working more and more on the lacquer finish to use water. Like all the faucets are equipped also with the aerator that uh, divide by two the water uh, usage. So that means usually a faucet for a lab is around 11 liter a minute. So if you buy one of us, it's five liter a minute. But you don't feel a difference. I don't spend that much time in the bathroom in reality. And, and you know, I'm, I'm somebody who do not even turn on the light when I go to the bathroom. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah don't smile, that's true. Uh, I don't know what is it. I think the perfect bathroom would be a bathroom outside, you know, get a super nice view like this. Uh, yeah, you get an open or with see the horizon or you can see the sea. That's always cool when you see the sea from your bathtub. You know, you know, like this. Uh, uh, and you hear the, the, the sound of the, of the wave, that's pretty cool. Thank you.